And what I want to know is, is Apple going to come sit at the table and play? Yeah, that's, because that's, yeah. That yeah. is where I think will be really, really interesting. Traditionally, I think Apple has had very little interest or desire to get into the creator space at all um, as like a personal obviously just a personal anecdote, but I've heard it echoed across the industry. I find that Spotify has actually been really interested in engaging with their creators. Um, I've been to the Spotify offices. They know our creators. They express interest in our creators creating podcasts. Apple, I would, um, like I've met with Apple, they're nice people, but I would struggle to put a name, um, a name to a face or have someone that I would be like, oh, okay, they're definitely interested in that space. I think Apple traditionally has played much more in the hardware and software space focused on their products yeah. rather than focused on the creators that are creating content for their platforms and products. Yeah. Um, but it will be interesting I... to see how they respond because they do dominate podcasting right now. I believe they make up like minimum 65% of the podcast. Really? sort of space it's so but... weird as an android person like i don't touch oh, apple like i don't dude, I can't know talk to you. yeah i don't know like <laughs> any i don't i'm an I apple haven't, girl through and through. i haven't been on itunes since 2008 man like i don't even know what yeah. that platform is so they dominate podcasting um but it'll be i i'd be interested to know if they even if they even wanted to play on the joe rogan deal like did they actually put up a serious offer I, I feel like I would be surprised if they did. And maybe they're just like, it's just not our area. We're not going to play in it. But it also feels like such a no brainer for them if they've, you know, they control that much of the market. Like, yeah. Dedicate some resources to keeping a hold on it because. I, I, I think they will. I, I, I think they will. I think it's, I think yeah. it's going to be, it's going to be like, uh, I mean, it's, it's literally like, I think it'll be so similar to what we saw with Mixer, Twitch and YouTube, where you've kind of got the three, everyone's kind of like assembling, you know, they're all like getting ready. They're, they're facing off and it's kind of like, they're looking at each other like, who's going to go first, huh? Like we're going to. But like, don't you do think they've but never, but as like, soon as they they've see, never been interested. Yeah. But they haven't been interested, but they're not dumb, right? They're, they're a billion, mm -hmm. billion, billion dollar company for a reason. The reason is they understand where value is and they, and they know how to like get it. I think that right now it's probably, I, I would more liken um, Apple to Twitch where at the start, you know, they're like, we are streaming. Like what, like what yeah. are we doing? Like we don't, we don't need like, you know, Twitch, we're, uh, vast majority of the time, like if you're talking to them about trying to negotiate like a deal for an individual creator, they're like, look, like what are you going to do? Like we're Twitch. Yeah, like you're, you're, the here. Audience. you're yeah. here. You're not going to, let's be, they're, they're like, let's be real. You're not, you're not going anywhere. Like let, let's be honest. We could literally yeah. halve what we pay you and you'd probably still stay. Like they, because they have that, that like confidence that they are the biggest and the best. But I think as soon as you see other players with big banks behind them making aggressive plays, like picking up some of the biggest podcasts in the world, taking them away from your platform and forcing people exclusively to go over to Spotify. I don't know if I was Apple, I would start worrying about like a domino effect. It's like, okay, I'm someone who used to listen to Joe Rogan on uh, iTunes. Then it's like, okay, now I have to go listen on Spotify. Well, I'm already on Spotify now. So I guess I may as well shift my music subscription to Spotify as well. And like, you know, yeah. like the... It, the the domino effect there is actually kind of scary yeah. and i True. i and i i think as soon as platforms see people making those moves like everyone gets fomo you know because they all yes. want to be the dominant force in that space and we know what this space is worth in the scheme of things 150 million is pennies so if they're like, we are currently at risk of falling behind in the podcast race, we need to make moves. I think they'll make moves.